Get ugly, y'all. They killed Gotti brother. Yeah, they killed Juke. Mine. Did Winchester? What did Winchester? What? Winchester. There's no, there's no, uh, uh, this is preliminary, so we hadn't developed a connection to that at this time. Um, it, we do feel like the individual that was uh, shot was possibly targeted by the suspect. We were hearing there was a repass or some sort of funeral procession going on over here at the time? Yes, these individuals, the two individuals that were shot were attending a repass uh, uh, at this location. Last question. How many... What you just heard is someone who was over there where Big Juke was uh, unfortunately deleted. Then the second clip you heard of Memphis Police Department talking about it. Uh, Big Juke, who is Yo Gotti's older brother, part of the CMG group, again was allegedly or was deleted last night. The unfortunate thing is they're saying that it happened at a wake or a repass. Of his uncle. Now as I'm on. Everybody's channels checking it out. I keep seeing people say. Dolph. Dolph. Or put the Dolph signs. Dolphin signs. And people. A lot of people from Memphis. Was calling in a different. On different people channels. Saying that. Big Juke got what. Was coming. And they start talking about karma. So of course. I start doing. My due diligence. And doing some research on it. And people saying that it may be involved with a Young Dolph situation. Now, Young Dolph, unfortunately, is no longer here. He passed away in a fortunate situation trying to go grab some cookies. But all of this may have allegedly been over Dolph not signing with Yo Gotti originally years and years ago. And I know they've been having like a, a back and forth. I remember Dolph having an album called Bulletproof and Yo Gotti not really responding, taking a higher road. But this is another unfortunate situation. At the end of the day, right, there may be a, a paper outside, a CMG side, but look at all these people that are no longer here. Now you got you got Dolph gone, who was getting more and more bigger. Remember, he's had all the, all his real estate. He was dropping all these gems. He gone. And now Yo Gotti brother, Big Juk gone. So you got two black men that's no longer going to be here. On top of people that we haven't heard of that's involved in this situation. It's just sad, man. It's sad, the culture. How much hate does somebody have in them to want to delete somebody at a repass? And also, so it was also a second person that was hit there too, but we don't know if they survived or not. Man, we need some help, man. Honestly, you know, rest in peace, Big Jug, rest in peace, Young Dolph. But none of this should be even going on in the first place. You know, and now people in Memphis talking about there's going to be retaliation against that. So now we're going to have more, more people who lives are about to be impacted because you know that there's some point it's going to be retaliation. I ain't saying from yo, yo Gotti, but you never know who the retaliation could come from. So I just want to get my quick thoughts on it, man. It's unfortunate. Rest in peace, big Juke. Tell me what y'all think.